All right, so I just wanted to uh, tell you a little bit about the resume and cover letter assignment. So for this week three, week four, um, so uh, as you know, you'll be submitting two documents, the resume and cover letter. Now the formatting for that, all the information, that'll be in the week three lecture video. <clears throat> um, but before you get started with it, I want you to first find um, a job posting or an internship posting. So these are real life job postings. Um, and then tailor both of your application documents to that position. So then um, imagine as if this were past graduation and you're looking for a job and you're actually going to apply. So it's as if you would actually apply for this job. Um, Okay, so you should choose um, one of two types of job postings, either an internship <clears throat> that's looking for the kind of experience that you either currently have now, so it's an internship you could actually apply for now, um, or that you anticipate having in the future. So it's either an internship that you could apply for now, or if it comes up again in the future, it's one you could actually apply for in the future once you have that level of experience or education. Um, or if you want to look for a job posting, um, it should be an entry level uh, job posting. So that means that it requires a bachelor's degree and no years of experience. So looking for a job posting that has that as the requirement. Um, so then uh, create your resume. You might already have a resume if that's the case. You can start with that as the base and then um, use the kind of information I give you in that week three lecture video to improve upon it, maybe redesign it, maybe add details, um, anything like that. Um, but you do want to tailor both documents to this job posting. So that means looking for those keywords in the posting putting those keywords in both documents. <clears throat> um, so then same thing for the cover letter. Follow my uh, lecture video for info on that. Um, I give you a sample format um, for the cover letter that you could download, use that as a template if you'd like. You don't have to. Um, but definitely just like any rough draft, focus more on the content um, than on the design or the formatting. Um, so, yeah, so that's it. That's for uh, this week's uh, rough draft assignment. Um, so good luck. Let me know if you have any extra questions and I'll see you later. Bye.